Good afternoon, everybody. Let's pray the Angelus. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. God begins. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, And she conceived of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Human Cooperation Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done to me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The supernatural event. And the word became flesh. And dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour forth, we beseech you, O Lord, your grace into our hearts, that we to whom the incarnation of Christ, your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. When God sends us, he goes with us. My dear sisters and brothers, one of the things that I learned about our God is that he being a God with us, a God for us, walks with us as we go about our life. And even when he sends us on a mission, he goes with us. And when we find ourselves in a situation, there he is with us to support us, to sustain us. And that's what I learned from the first reading of the day, where the three young men who are devoted to the Lord are thrown into the fiery furnace by King Nebuchadnezzar. The king and his courtiers look down and see not three men, but four of them. And they are left wondering, did we not throw in only three men, and how come we see a fourth one? Our God is a God who walks with us. And when he sends us on a mission, he goes with us. And so the question that you and I could sit with today is just this. Do I always take the trouble to feel the presence of God with me, especially as I come face to face with some challenge? Have a blessed day.